Who is she? And why was she scouting Israel's northern border? Two of many questions still unanswered after a Russian broker deal between Israel and Syria to return an Israeli woman who had crossed the border. The deal to bring her home was dubbed humanitarian by Israel's top brass. We immediately began operating for her release. We emphasized to the other side that we are talking about a civilian and thus a humanitarian issue, not a security one. Ultimately, though, this humanitarian incident poses many questions, not least of which is whether it's connected to the COVID-19 pandemic. Did Israel provide vaccines to Syria as part of the deal? Did it buy vaccines from Russia? Some details of the deal are still under military censorship in Israel, but foreign reports indicate Israel may have done either or both these things. Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu has quite bluntly said that not one dose of Israeli vaccines was in any way connected to the deal, but the question remains. The 25-year-old Israeli who crossed the border is back in Israel, and the Syrian demands for prisoners to be released in exchange for her return have been met. But even with the issues seem settled, without a shadow of a doubt, there are still many unanswered questions which remain unsettling.